Hello, everybody, and welcome. Today is March 2nd, so that means that we are going to take a look at some of the cards that we received for the Caring Card Makers card drive. And just a reminder that this month's cards is are going to the Ronald McDonald House in Albany, New York. And at the end of this video, I'll have all of the information for the next month. So we're going to start off with some cards from Madeline. And she has these so nicely tied up with this cute little ribbon. And she sent lots and lots of cards. So the first one here says Dream Big. And it's got a dry embossed background. The next one is I Think You're Cool. That is so cute. Love the little frame there and the ink blending. Hope your day is real nice with a little ice fishing scene there. Very cute. Another dream big with this little super dog here. We have the Just Because You're Amazing. I love this card. I'm a sucker for flowers, but this is just beautiful. And you may be able to hear Macy in the background. She um, wants the window open and it's just a little too windy for that. <laughs> A little beach scene here, seize the day. The world is lucky to have you. I love that sentiment. And oh, this has so much dimension. I love that with the alcohol ink background. Another one, the world is lucky to have you. I love the stars. Hope your days are bright. Love the rainbow. Thank you so much, Madeline, for all of these beautiful cards. Next, we have a bunch of cards from Amy, and she's got this, start with this cute shaker card with the little goldfish. I love that. She has those stuck with some foam tape so they don't move around, but the sequins do. Love that card, and I love how she assigned it from lots of people. So the um, families from the Ronald McDonald house will have lots and lots of love you deserve a woohoo. I love that. I happen to say that all the time. <laughs> and these cute little critters up here. Love that. Can we talk about how fabulous you are? Oh, I love these cards. Love the, oh, I love these colors. Love the ice cream. You are totally awesome. Beautiful ink blending here. Oh, I recognize this one from Trinity Stamps. <laughs> one of my favorite stamp sets of all time. Love this. Beautiful rainbow and heart. Sending hugs. And these are all little individual shakers. Wow. That has to be a lot of work. <laughs> Hang in there. No lion, you're the best. <laughs> Love these little punny sentiments. You're amazing with the banner. Another beautiful ink blended background with some embossed resist. And smile. I love this little scene here. So pretty. Thank you so much. Next, we have some cards from Donna who said she um, would like me to share just a couple of them online or on YouTube, I should say. Um, so I'm just going to show you a couple of them, but um, they're all gorgeous. So I'm only going to show you the top two because I can't pick my favorite. Um, she's got this beautiful, beautiful floral. And then she's got another floral here with some foiling. And some of these, she wrote little riddles on the inside for kids. And I thought that that was such a cute idea. It really puts a smile on their face and gives them a little something extra. So thank you very much, Donna. I Trust me, guys, these are all beautiful. <laughs> Next, we have a card from Erin. And I love this image here. I love the black and white. Wake up, kick butt, repeat. Perfect for an encouraging card for anybody at the Ronald McDonald House. Love this card. Next, we have lots of cards from Yvette, so lots and lots of them. Um, think happy thoughts. Such a perfect, encouraging sentiment. You are simply the best ever. I love the pearls here. It just adds so much. You're doing awesome. Love the ink blending on this. You're doing a fantastic job. Again, with those pearls. Oh, I love those pearls. 
Another Think Happy Thoughts. Hugs, Every Little Thing is Going to Be All Right. Love that song, by the way. <laughs> Love the framing here. Today is a good day to smile. Oh, this is beautiful. Look for the miracles. Oh, that is such a pretty background. And all of these are embossed. Love is an art that comes from the heart. How true. Have a beautiful day. Love the butterflies. Love is everything. You're the best thing since sliced bread. <laughs> Sending love, which is, this is a shaker card. This background is gorgeous. I think that's the, um, oh, what do you call it? Hmm. Yvette, please comment. Let me know what this is. Um, the shimmer powder, I think it's called. Um, I got to get me some of these, this, because this is gorgeous. Oh, she has some more. <laughs> Sending love. Oh, I love these so much. Love that, how she used the negative and the positive. Some more beautiful ink blending. Everyone agreed you're fantastic, amazing, and incredible. I hope you always find a reason to smile. Thinking of you, the butterflies again. <laughs> Hello. Be strong, go with your heart, and believe in miracles because anything can happen. How true. So encouraging. Sending you hugs. Love that die cut. And smile, you're not alone. Love these cards, Yvette. Thank you so much. Next cards are from Edna. And she has a little interactive card here. The, the peanut butter to my jelly with a little toast coming out of the toaster. That's so cute. Best fishes. I love the bubbles. The dry embossed bubbles. Love that. Sending you loads of love. Another dry embossed. And she did some die cutting here too. That's very pretty. Greetings. <laughs> I love this. I don't know whether this is an embossing folder because it also has some die cutting. So I don't know if you can comment and let me know what that is because I also need to get my hands on that. <laughs> Enjoy the adventure. Let your beauty run wild. And I love this. It's got the little baby tiger. But when you open the card, you still have the mama tiger. Love that. Special delivery. Oh, sending you loads of love. Another interactive card. I'm so bad at those, but I love looking at them. <laughs> and honestly, this is the first time I ever actually got to play with one. <laughs> You're the sweetest. Beautiful hummingbird there. Cherish each moment. Oh, I, oh, I love that. <laughs> Get the cat. <laughs> That's so cute. Sending you loads of love with Minnie Mouse there. You're a bowl of sunshine. So cute. I love the colors here. There's nobody better or beta, actually, than you. I should say beta because of the beta fish. And again, I love that bubble embossing folder you used. Just relax. Love how she put the little yoga mat underneath her. You are qualified as my best friend. <laughs> That's so cute. You're a real chum with the uh, hammerhead shark. Be a kind human. I love that. I love how you do the windows so that you can still see the inside. Sending kisses and hedge hugs your way. Very cute. Sending lots of love and smiles. Look at that cute little dog. Oh, and the little rock and roll cat here. <laughs> Absolutely love it. Thank you so much, Edna. Next, we have a card from Olivia, who also, I came across a video that she did 
for this card. So I will try to find that and link it below. Um, also, if you're watching, you could always link it below so people can take a look at it. Um, beautiful, beautiful coloring here. Beautiful ink blending. Just a gorgeous card. Thank you so much. Next, we have some fun goodies from Eileen, and she has a matching bookmark for every single card. And I just think that that's so unique and just a little something extra for everybody. So I'm just going to flip through these and show you all the bookmarks that go along with them. She even has the ribbon for them. They are so, so cute. And it's a two for one. People get a card and a bookmark. And I imagine if for anything like me, when I'm stuck someplace and have to get my mind off of things, I like to read. So I'm assuming that there's a lot of people from the Ronald McDonald house that are doing a lot of reading. These are so pretty. I love these hearts. They're sparkly. I don't know whether you guys can see it, but they are very, they're not overly sparkly. Like it's not like loose glitter, but it's got like this shimmer to it. They're so pretty. I just love these papers that you used. Very, very pretty pattern paper. Oh, I like this one. Oops. Oh, that was for me. <laughs> beautiful, beautiful. Thank you so much, Eileen. Next, we have some cards from Joan, and these are super fun. Look at all of that. Oh my gosh. It looks like the skirt. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. So very cute. These are all in packaging here. Joan is actually from Denmark. So these traveled a very long way. Love the dimension and the shine on this one. You are a gem. Love the background paper too. Super cool. <laughs> this is really cute. Very, very cute. I love the brads that you used. And if I can get this one back in here. Boys rule. <laughs> Joan is amazing at making masculine cards. She is so good at it. I'm not. <laughs> but I love how she distressed this piece of pattern paper here. She's got a little video game here and a baseball cap. Super cute. Oh, this is adorable. Oh my gosh, she's got a little action wobbler on there. That is so cute. You are the sweetest. Love that, Joan. When an elephant, just a note. That is a, an adorable die cut. So, so cute. Sending showers of love. And I love looking at Joan's cards, not only because she's extremely talented and extremely um, generous with her cards, but she lives in a different country. So she gets to use different products that we don't necessarily get to use here in the state. So I love, I love looking at them. She's got this sending showers of love coming out of the envelope. So cute. Oh, this is so adorable. Look at the little teddy bear in the bathtub. And the bathtub she cut from mirror cardstock, so it looks metallic. So cute. And I absolutely love her big, big cards. Look at this beautiful unicorn. Oh my gosh. Some of these hearts are shimmery. So, so pretty. And there's a lot of dimension here. You can see that there's a ton of dimension. Oh, and the lion. I'm a lion lover. Oh, this has so much dimension. It's like one of those 3D decoupage things where there's different layers. Very, very pretty. Kids are going to love those. I love those. <laughs> Thank you so much, Joan. Next, we have some cards from Vicki, and she's got a little B scene here, just because. Love that. And little snowmen, because unfortunately, yes, it is still winter, <laughs> with the little snowman, or snowmen, and the high, and she's got a, used an embossing folder here for like falling snow. 
Some more snowmen. Love this pattern paper. A little note. Just got these popped up. Today will be awesome. And this is fabulous ink blending. Like fabulous ink blending. <laughs> love that. Oh, this is gorgeous. The hello and love how she matted that on the black and the pink just to make it stand out a little bit more. Oh, that's so pretty. That had to take you a little bit of time to cut all that foam tape out. <laughs> And sending thoughts of love and praying for the Lord to sustain you with bright and restless, restful days. Restful days. Miss some daisies on here. Very, very pretty. Thank you so much. Next, we have a couple cards from Beth showing off her amazing, amazing, amazing ink blending skills. Um, I'm always in awe when I see her ink blending because she just makes it look so seamless and I just don't get results like that. I have to usually hide it with something. Um, but they are both the same images. Um, they are heat embossed, but totally different colors. Absolutely love these cards. Thank you so much, Beth. So that are that is all of the cards that I received for the Caring Card Makers Drive this month. And now we'll talk a little bit about the next month. So this month we are going to be donating to the Cards for Hospitalized Kids, which is an organization that collects the cards and distributes them to hospitals all over the country for kids in hospitals. Um, the cards must be received by April 1st, 2020 to be delivered and shown on the YouTube video. Please be sure that the cards are kid friendly with no loose glitter or embellishments. You want to be sure to use encouraging sentiments, nothing like get well or feel better, and no religious sentiments or images. You want to make sure that you sign your first name only. Now for the giveaway for this month, our winner is Edna. And Edna receives a $25 gift card to the Not Too Shabby Shop. So Edna, please email me to claim that. And this month's winner will receive a $25 gift card to Simon Says Stamp. So I want to thank everybody for who participated this month. And I look forward to see what you guys create next month. Thanks, guys. Have a great day. Bye.